friends what's up this is rk from 360 reader right now i'm going to show how you can set up emergency calls using siri on your iphone ios 14.5 has got some really cool features including the ability to unlock iphone with apple watch all new siri voices and the option to change default music there is one more equally exciting feature that lets you set up emergency calls using siri in ios 14.5 on your iphone however if you want to get the most out of this live saving feature you will need to first set it up to be more precise you will need to add an emergency contact to your iphone once that's done activating emergency calls with siri is a breeze that all being said let me help you unlock this well thought out feature before getting started make sure you have subscribed our youtube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 reader First off, let's add an emergency contact to your iPhone. To get it done, launch the health app on your device and then tap on the profile. After that, tap on medical ID and then tap on the edit button. Next, scroll down to the emergency contact section and then tap on add an emergency contact. After that, select a contact from your address book and then add the, you know, relationship. In the end, make sure to tap on done at the top right corner of the screen to finish. Once you have added the emergency contact, contact make sure you have enabled hey siri to get it done go to the settings app on your iphone and then choose siri and search after that make sure the switch for listen for hey siri is turned on now if you ever want to make emergency calls all you need to do is just say the hey siri call my emergency contact phrase and the virtual assistant will get the job done for you it's worth pointing out that the feature works whether you are in need of assistance or someone else is by default the i iOS device plays a warning sound, starts a countdown, and then calls the emergency services. And when the emergency call ends, iPhone alerts your emergency contacts that you made a call and sends them to your current location. Do know that you can also activate emergency SOS by clicking the side button of your iPhone three or five times. In some countries or regions, your location information may be accessed by emergency service providers when you make an emergency call. You can check your carrier's emergency calling information to understand the limits of emergency calling over Wi-Fi. With CDMA, when an emergency call ends, the iOS device enters emergency call mode for a few minutes to allow a call back from emergency services. During this time, data transmission and text messages are disabled. Once you have made an emergency call, certain call features that block or silence incoming calls may be turned off for a short period of time to allow a call back from emergency services. These features include do not disturb, silence unknown callers, and screen time. That's all there is to it. So that's the way you can make emergency calls with Siri on your iOS device. If you have found this guide helpful, do like and share it and i'll see you in the next video with more such helpful tips and tricks till then stay safe and have a great time bye bye